Alright, how's it going everybody? I'm Samurai Man, and welcome back to Flashback, the quest for identity. Uh, when we last left off, I died in a really kind of retarded way, but I'm back here again, and I forgot to show you something last time. If you actually hold down the action button, you can use this little thing. It's actually an elevator. Uh, usually, you can identify them throughout the game by these little... Uh, double handlebar railing things. You'll see what I mean. We'll see a lot more of these in the future. Anyway, I'm gonna head on over here. There we go, we got the epic music going again. And here we go. Bam. Now, I'm definitely not gonna roll this time. I definitely not wanna fall down there. I know I've made that mistake so many times playing this game. All right, now we have here an elevator puzzle. We, if you see here, we've got like these uh, little sensors here. If you walk over them, they do different things. We got over on the other side. This sensor brings the elevator up. Obviously, you saw the other one brings it down. So we just want to leap on over it and avoid it. Head on up here. This one, okay, it brings it up. This one brings it down. So let's head on over. Go on up the elevator and take a little jog. So we got a little dude here. Help! Help! Alright. My four times of voice acting. <laughs> At play there. Wounded man. Help me, young man. I've been attacked by mutants. And I can't walk. Find my teleporter. I need urgent medical assistance. Alright. He needs some medical assistance. Let's head back on up here. Okay, so obviously we don't have a teleporter yet, but we'll find one later on, and we can probably help that guy out. Let's move on. Head on over this way. I'm trying to avoid just talking about what I'm doing, but there's not a whole lot to say when you're commentating, I guess. You know, I was going to do like a really silly Family Feud style opening to the episode, but it didn't feel right to me. If you've ever seen Family Feud, uh, you know, like, I don't know if there's a an overseas version or not, but the American version right now is hosted by Steve Harvey. He's a pretty funny guy. Okay, so I've got, as you can see, I've got my shield recharged. My cartridge is charged up. So now we can go over to that bridge. We want to carefully, oh, wait. <sighs> Elevators can't. You can't like climb down on the elevator because of the elevator controls. So I'm gonna have to do a little run and jump. No, no. Just to get over the little electricity. You know, you don't want to get zapped by that. That would suck. Head on up and over. Running and jogging and climbing around. I'm gonna stop singing, sorry. What am I doing? There we go. Ba -ba -do -ba -do. Now we're back here again. We've got the cartridge locked, so select the cartridge and use it. Need a animation here with the cool sounds. I think all the sounds in this game are really awesome. I don't know why. Oh, it's a little robot friend. It's gonna probe me. Oh no. Oh. I forgot the explosion hurts. Okay. <laughs> I gotta be more careful about that in the future, I guess. Let's not step on the electricity here. Now, remember I said about identifying these elevators, there's a little elevator here. A lot of people might not even see this on their first playthrough, but you can kind of go up here. Um, before I do that, though, I want I know there's a save point on the next screen over. I really want to get that. Because, like I said, I wasn't going to blatantly cheat with save states, but I'm going to use them for the save points because, well, let me just show you. Let's see if I can get down here and make sure it's safe. Might as well take care of this little robot buddy here. Don't want him to probe me. Head on up. Head on up. And jump the wrong way. Okay, this is a save point. 
Now, uh, let me make sure I've got the right slot here. Now I'm going to use save states for these save points because I'll show you here in a second. First I'm going to save. Now watch what happens when you use one of these. Saving, please wait. Do 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 Okay. Well that wasn't as long as I remember. I guess uh the emulator is a bit faster than my Sega Genesis, but still save state would probably be a lot better and a lot quicker. So that's what I'm gonna do from now on. Let's head back on over here. Don't wanna like walk off just in case it's dangerous. I know it's not here, but in future reference, you know. Okay, that was, don't know what I was thinking there. My mind was elsewhere. Let's try this again. Do, 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 do. Heading on up, heading on up. Jumping over electricity. I don't know why I'm singing so much. Lack of anything else to say? Robots. Jump on over here. Coming up here. I'm like just totally out of things to say here. Now, have you noticed that little uh, sensor there brought the elevator down? So let's pick up this stone. We need to put something in front of that sensor. One second. And I'm back. You may have seen a little bit of a cut there. I just got interrupted by a phone call, but it's all good now. And I'm resuming the entertainment. So I've got a stone equipped now. I'm going to actually set this here in front of the sensor. And you might notice there's a little little pixelated block thing on the elevator that just came down. What is this? It's a teleporter. Yep. Head on over. Might as well pick up the stones so this little beeping sensor thing isn't annoying the heck out of us. So what do you suppose we can get in exchange for a teleporter? Let's find out, shall we? But before we go help out the uh, the injured guy, I believe we open access to another location. You may not have noticed it, but when I went up in the other elevator... Uh, one second, save state. When I went up to the other elevator it opened a little hole in the ground that I can climb down into and we're gonna explore that first you know might as well cover our bases while we're at it <laughs> don't touch the electricity epic music alright now this is a very tricky situation kinda well not really if you know what you're doing just pull out the gun do the little drop and shoot trick. Boom. Boom. Owned. Alright. Let's head on up here to the charging station. Make sure our shield is maxed out. Alright. Yeah, we need a little charge. Now, as epic as this little cutscene is, I like to skip it after a while. It just gets a little bit old. You know, don't want to be too stale. So, let's head on over here. Put out the gun just in case. Maybe do a little roll. Okay, now we've got a tricky situation. This here is a switch. What this does is it shuts off the flame. But this is a beginner's trap because there's a little sensor on the ground here. Watch what happens. Oh, don't want to run into that. So we're going to head on over, hit the switch again, and jump over the sensor. Head on over this way. Get the little probie robot and roll away so it didn't blow up in our face again. Definitely don't want that. Get a little uh, slime drip. I don't think that slime can hurt you. Now, we've got a little trick we can do here with rocks. Uh, it might be obvious to a gamer. Just chuck it. This game is pretty creative. And I don't know how he flew back towards me when I shot him, but whatever. There's 100 credits on the ground here. And we're going to keep on moving. Slime is harmless. Oh, this part. I do not like this part. 
Now, you see these little turret things on the side here. These are not your friend. They seem harmless now, but... Uh, there's a key here, by the way. Ooh, doo -doo 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 -doo. I gotta remember to do that. Get the key now, because it's gonna be hard as hell to get it later. No. Oh, wait, what's this? Oh, 50 credits on the ground. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Mm -hmm. Okay. And now we have a tricky situation here. Oh! Uh, actually, I didn't really know it was coming. <laughs> and this guy's gonna kill us if I'm not careful. Jeez Louise. Okay. What are we at? Two shield. That's alright, there's a shield charging station here. Now there's a little sensor right here. This is the tricky part. If you hit that sensor, those two turrets I was pointing out before are going to start, they're going to activate, and they're going to be hard to avoid. I think it's possible to jump over the sensor, but let's, I'm not sure, let's try. Nope, it's not. And you might be hearing them now. Skip that. Now, the reason why we came here in the first place is there's this neat little, uh, uh what was it, 500 credits. We're going to need those for later. Do -do 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 -do. And the reason why is there's going to be someone later that's going to be asking for some money in order to progress. So we need to get all the credits we could find up until then. Now this part, like I said, is really tricky because it requires some timing. It might not be as tricky as I'm remembering, but I think we're going to save that for next time because that's about all for this episode today. But I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys later. Good night.